exciting, frustrating game. Well, remember, it was a week ago after the loss against Boston College that the head of the Board of Trustees of Florida State University said we need to close out the Bowden era after this season. Bobby Bowden countering saying, I'll evaluate myself at the end of the season. T.K. Weatherall, the school president of Florida State, in support of Bobby Bowden saying they will make no changes until the end of the season. But an important caveat, he did say that any coach can step away when he wants to. Well, Florida State with 539 yards, Georgia Tech with 532. And what is going through Bobby Bowden's mind right now? They're going to drop to two and four overall, and they'll lose three consecutive games for the they, first time ever in ACC they, play. And they've lost five of their last six in Dope Campbell Stadium, Mark. Don't minimize what that means. They gave it a good run tonight, but coming up five points short. Georgia Tech improves to five and one overall, three and one in conference play. Setting up a great game next week on ESPN2 at 6 p.m. Eastern time against Virginia Tech. Once again, our final score, Georgia Tech 49, Florida State 44. Coming up next, it's baseball tonight with a wrap-up of all the day's action in Major League Baseball playoff action. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. For Bob Davey and our entire production crew, I'm Mark Jones saying so long from Tallahassee.